Welcome to Gray Matters presentation, U.S. State Flag Mnemonics. This particular presentation is part of a series which together teach methods to remember the flags of all 50 U.S. states, plus Washington, D.C. I've tried to create mnemonics that use as little detail as possible from each flag to help you identify them quickly. On many state flags, the name of the state is included. In these cases, I'll hide the name of the state until I finish describing the mnemonic. In this video, we're going to focus on state flags with shields. Our first state flag has two characters with colorful capes and costumes and a banner that says Excelsior. Now characters with colorful capes and costumes make me think of Marvel Comics where Stan the Man Lee's favorite phrase is Excelsior. Marvel Comics is based in New York just like many of its own superheroes such as Spider-Man and the Fantastic Four so it shouldn't be too hard to think of this as the New York flag. On this state flag, we have grapevines growing around what could be arbors or trellises. To properly maintain grapevines on a trellis, you have to do two main things over and over again. Connect and cut, connect and cut, connect and cut. The Connecticut flag is easy to remember. See the lions coming out of the star up here? It almost looks like a lion's mane. Imagine there's a lion up there and he's hungering for a taste of moose. Once you see the mane around the star, you'll never forget the state's name is Maine. This state flag is almost like a rebus. There's a miner with a candle on his hat. Now, I like to think of this as the old-fashioned version of having a light bulb going on over your head, as if you're having an idea. So he has a candle going on over his head. That means he's wise. Perhaps this idea he had has to do with the cones down here at the bottom. They're lead ingots. Also, think of him as the other man's son. This man has a beard. He doesn't, so it, he looks younger. Think of this as... Wise, Cones, Sun. This is the flag for Wisconsin. The state flag has two black horses that almost disappear against a dark blue background. That shield in the center is roughly the shape of a light bulb. The light bulb is giving us enough light to see the difference. Oh, and this light bulb is made by Sylvania. And the horses want to be seen, so they're trying to pin it down so nobody takes it. They're trying to pen Sylvania. This is the Pennsylvania state flag. If you look, there's a man in the middle holding a long gun. Now, he could use it to hunt the elk, the moose, the eagle, but he has a problem. He's holding it right where land meets water, and that means mud. Imagine his gun is stuck in the mud. It's no longer a dry gun. It's a mushy gun. This is the flag of Michigan. Our final flag has a lot of stuff that appears to be furry. The pine branches on the outside, the pine tree, the wheat, even the cow and the deer at the top of the flag could be said to be furry. The only thing that doesn't look furry in this flag is the mountains. So you can think of this as the fur mount flag. This is the flag for Vermont. That's all the U.S. state flag mnemonics for this video. Please check the rest of the series.